Hey, what's up there guys, and 2 mdx and we got a cool little video today on my new Pi Mini. Um, slow it up for a second. So, what we're running here today is the Hermes Light 2, which the uh, HL2 Pi, Pi Mini, and the Blue Yeti, USB mic. I got a Bluetooth keyboard and mouse, but you can get any which one. There's a nicer one on Amazon, which I'm eyeing. I'm going to buy. This is something I had laying around. We have a Bluetooth speaker, and you can, as you can see, I got two Bluetooth devices working at the same time. We also got, aha, got a little controller from, um, that I used to use on, well, I still use on the Theodis and well, the, for PC, I had a program, and as you know, I made that video for you guys, but this one's just plug and play, just plug it in, and away she goes, look, Raceway Park, look at that, anyway, so, let me tell you what I did with this thing, this thing's pretty cool, isn't this so nice, I like, I like, HL2 Pi Pi Mini, something I came up with out of my head, just to be different from everybody else. So 3D printed, uh, no, the STL, L, STL files are not available. This is my own design that took me weeks to design and put together. And I am selling the product, so why would I offer the STLs? Just saying. I could make STLs for people if they need that. I, that's what I do. I design. I make skins and the amplifier. We build everything here in the N2MDX laboratories. Um, so let me show you something here. I sound like Jim Carrey. This is just a stand. This is not the stand for it. I actually going to build. Uh, I'll be printing out today the little feet, which I'll show you in the next video. I just want to get this out so I can show you guys. And it'll be available on my site um, for sale. I'll stop posting pictures. And they won't go into stock count until probably maybe Sunday or Monday. So I'll keep, I'll keep you posted on that or just keep checking on the website. So what you have here is a five inch touch screen, a Raspberry Pi 5, eight gig. I think you could do four also, I think it'll be fine. It's uh, land connected to the Hermes, okay? And this is the back and some vents and a fan is in here. You get the fan, a heat sink. So well cooled down. Okay. Um, let's see, we're on 40 right now. Let me just change my antenna real quick. And so. Um, Now, you could use the wheel, I could use this, my finger. As soon as you let go, it locks right to the uh, frequency. Click tune. Was tuned for um, I think I was tuned on 80 somewhere from last night. Two meter. Um, oh, that'll help. All right, now we're all tuned up. Get my 
microphone. Right now I have a pedal hooked up, but I'll show you something. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Test, test. One, two, three, four. And two empty ears. Test, test. So that's with the foot pedal, and then you can also use the look. If you didn't want to have a foot pedal, I guess, let's say you're in the park somewhere, you could hit the mox. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay. You could use your mouse. Now, let me see something here. This is this keyboard that I'm messing with now, right? But I want to see something. Oh, it does work. So a little space bar in here. A little space bar. Let's see. Let's try to get it in the video. There it is. One, two. All right, so the space ball works on the little keyboard. So you got so many ways to to key up the Hermes. <clears throat> Excuse me. So you want to go two receivers, huh? No problem. So if I want to lower this first one, or make it louder, I can put this one here. I'll click on this one, raise the volume on this one. And let's change the band because I'm going to add antenna. So we'll go to. So one's on 80, and this one's on 40. <coughs> you want to see the filters? There's all your band filters. Okay. And our one and our two. And just so you know, you see like what the mouse, the mouse pointer is, make sure it's, before you start messing with this, this little gadget here, make sure the mouse pointer is pointed at the waterfall. Because if you're on the zoom button like I was, it'll get you all confused. This is NR2. No, it's actually an eight cut. And Sounds so good. And you got your TX drive. One thing I want to tell you that I've done in the past with this. One time I had the TX drive. You could see it down there. One time I had it all the way down. I thought I had no output. I thought the thing. I thought I did so. I was like, oh my god, what happened? So when you first get, make sure you got some TX drive. Okay. So yeah, that's the Pi Mini. Um, and like I said, these will be available soon. If you place your order, just give me time to build it. Usually takes a couple of days. And then um, how I'm gonna pack these now? What I'm thinking about here with this is offering them with a, they'll come with a pouch. 
its own pouch where it slides in. So it'll be, and when they get boxed, they'll be of course protected and everything. Custom boxes for them. So I got to do all that, you know. Money and time, of course, and like I said, little the little hinge feet um, that I'm gonna design. They're kind of like the uh, the ones on the Maestro. You know, I seen somebody post them, so I want to take those and just edit them a little bit and make them nice, and we'll design them for this. So yeah, and like I said, this this design is something I design, and then the same thing for the for the plates. You know, if you look at the um, the Hermes, it's the same thing, same exact thing, and I wanted to match. So when they're, laying, they're sitting on a table and you're out in the field, people are like, wow, look at that. I know, I was like, that is a cool setup. And <clears throat> so here's another thing, too. You got this on the table, you're out there, you know, maybe parks on the air or you just, you know, QRP, whatever. Um, I do have another box that I'm designing, okay, because the Raspberry Pi is 5 volts. So I have the converter and everything for 12. Now, this box will house the converter and it'll have outputs for more 12 volt so 12 volt in either by battery pack or power supply when you're in the field it'll supply the Raspberry Pi and the Hermes all at the same time and that's it that'll be a little power bank okay all your connections boom 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 done this right here is connected to the, the wall ward that's connected to a power strip down below and that's it. And you know what? You don't have to use uh, a big USB microphone. You could use a headset, and that'll give you your receive and your mic with the boom on the headset. So you got that, too, for USB. They have those on. I don't know how well they sound. I know this Yeti sounds great on it, though. So, um, yeah, I'm very excited about this. It came out great. So, you know, I tried this with a 70 screen. It was just, it was just massive. I was like, oh, God. No, seven screens nice, but not when you're not when you're portable. There's no need, you know. Um, yeah, there was some other stuff too I I want to talk about as far as the QRP stuff. Oh, you want to know something? In my next video, I'm gonna do something for you guys. Um, so stay tuned. I just picked up. Oh God. I just picked up some clones. <laughs> I picked up a uh, TLM-103 clone. And, um, yeah. I'm going to test these out. I might even take the capsules out, modify them. I don't know. I'm going to do something with them, but that's for a new video. We'll try them out on the Hermes. Gonna try them out on the 710. So that's one. And I got a uh, another clone here. A U87. A U87 clone. How are they built? The shock melt is good for nothing. It's cheesy. It's, you know, I get. I, I think I could have 3D printed this better myself. But that's just me. That's what you get from China. And the mic is okay. If it's, it's, you know, nothing like a real U87. But then again, you're going to spend about $3,000 or better. So, yeah, I'll do videos on those uh, just to see what the audio sounds like. I w I'm going to test them out on the 710 I just got in the shack, which we're going to do a video on soon. But, yeah, getting back to the, uh, the Pi Mini here. This thing is very cool. Um, the left hand side is the list of all the things that you can add to a container. So you scroll all the way down, and the second to last thing on the list is filter display. And then you hit the little arrow to move it over into the container. And then you can highlight filter display, and you can adjust uh, all the parameters right there. Over. I do not have a filter display. The very bottom is two steps. Oh, 
Rogers today. He's uh, uh, spending the week. My, my uh, bandwidth filters are out a little wide. Um, that's probably why we're hearing. Let's go to 2.9. And... Bring the game. Bring some AGC. So, that's the pod mini, guys. Hope you like it, because I certainly do. Alright, and like I said, these will be available soon on my website. If you have any questions, uh, my email is good on QRZ. You can hit me up that way. Um, yeah. Pi mini, coming soon. There was something else I want to tell you guys. Um, it probably come to me after the video, and I'll be like, "Ah, oh, damn!" Just that always happens. But um, now, like I said, those little feet things are gonna be really cool, and they'll fold up and, and tuck away. You can slide it right into the pouch. Put the Hermes in the in your pouch, whatever. You know. Or one of those uh, gator cases, put both pieces in, put your cables in there, your headset, your little uh, power bank box that I'll be making, put it all in there, go out to the field, boom, have fun. I'm going to do that this spring, I can't wait. And I'm going to make some videos in the park with this. That's going to be cool. Yep. I have a, um, a few little mobile antennas, portable antennas that I have. I have a vertical one, and I have a, um, a little uh, back in the day, a little LDG box. I got one of those with some wire on it, and we'll tune it up. <clears throat> tuna, tuna, tuna. Yeah, that's something else I'm doing. Yeah, the HL2 tuna. That's coming. But anyway, uh, yeah, got a lot of things going on here. So. I hope you enjoyed the video. Again, please like, subscribe, share. Uh, I do appreciate it. 7-3, um, all the best.